Meat glue. How to spot when you're looking at different types of meat. Do you see the different circles? It looks like there are different pieces of meat that are glued together inside this big pack. Now look at this. You can see cracks. These cracks and separations show that they were trying to glue these pieces together with meat glue. And you should be able to see very easy. Look at this. This is the separation between the different types of meats that they tried to glue together. A lot of the times, the meat will stick together. However, the fat will not stick to the meat. So you can see the separation. Especially right here, you can see clearly where they cut out the different types of meat and glued different types of meat back to it. The cracks here in the fat, they just can't glue fat together very well. Now look at this. This whole thing of ham, this big thing of ham, is a bunch of pieces of meat glued together along with this other type of sandwich meat. All of your lunch meats are glued together with mechanically separated meats and lots of salts. It's not just beef either, but also ham. When you look at a ham slice, even though there is a bone, you can clearly see where the different pieces of ham or pork were glued together and you can see the separation in the packs. Just because meat has a bone doesn't mean that there isn't any glue being used. Look at this huge premium top round roast beef. For $24, if that was real, it'd be a lot more expensive. All of your chicken and turkey meats are just globs of chicken and turkey glued together. Leave me some comments down below and let me know what you think about this meat glue situation.